Um, I wanted to make friends um, in relationship to the WPA prints that were made in the United States, sort of um, dealt with social, the social fabric of the United States, so I thought I wanted to try to do this. My main interest coming here is to try to make a colored print because I don't make prints in color for the most part, or I rarely do, not on purpose, and I don't really understand color, so um, Crown Point is very famous for their color etchings, and so um, I wanted to come and try to learn about it, but I'm making it that the color is separate from the image. I don't understand why people use color. I don't mind it in other people's work, but for myself, um, I rarely use color. Um, you know, etching is a um, has a great history in black and white, and um, you know, etching is something you can spend your lifetime trying to learn about. I like that you know that you put a tremendous amount of work into something, and then you can make multiple images, or you can change those images to make them sort of monotypes or something between unique things and, and multiples, but, you know, I guess I also think that if you're going to spend your time doing something, you might as well make more than one. I'm not interested in the, I mean, I like making drawing a lot too, but a lot of my drawings are made um, by collaging prints. I like multiple images and I like multiple examples of the same image and I like that you can manipulate them. I mean I wanted to make oil slicks or rainbows or oil slicks and so we're making a kind of um, marbleized texture or something like that. You know and I guess in relationship to the image I wanted it like that you have an image and then that the color which is maybe like a kind of optimistic thing is separated from that image. You know, it's like the the underside of the rainbow or something like that. Uh, friends of mine that have made prints here have had wonderful experiences over the years and, you know, come back over and over again and, um, you know, I think Crown Point has made very famous prints, you know, that stick in the sort of cultural mind of the print world. Um, so it's exciting to be here.